Yo, what's happening, the world? Name's Raheem Flowers, and this is another case of the chickens coming home to roost, starting at cannon. You know, he was a child celebrity at one point, and he hosted things on Nickelodeon. We all know that he cuffed Mariah Carey, and then he went on America's Got Talent and then transitioned on to this Afrocentric, or as I like to call it, pseudo neo pro black these days. He went through that whole rabbit hole. And now it's coming to catch up with him. Not because he was talking about white people or white supremacy, because he went on Vlad TV doing that but because he talked about the good old Jewish community. Yup. <laughs> so, after all the references he made with Francis Cress Welsing and the ISIS paper, apparently, from everything he said about how white people formed and how they came to earth and basically the whole Yakub talking point from saying all oh, going on this diatribe but the moment he said that it's the melanated man or the so-called blacks who are the original Jews that's when all hell broke loose Nick Cannon didn't even realize what he did he just debunked white supremacy. His whole spiel and what he got in trouble for debunked white supremacy and just further proves that a lot of the powers that be are heavily influenced by those small hats that you see in the streets. with the culture meals. Yup. Man, oh man, oh man. How you gonna explain this one, Nick? What you gonna do? You, oh wait, my bad. You already apologized. You apologized and you bowed down so quickly. You see, you didn't have to apologize to the so-called Caucasians just the Caucasian Jewish ones. Ain't that something? See? So for every, every dude, every black chick, every individual who talks about white supremacy, you just have to look no further than Nick Cannon's case. You see? I wonder how Tariq Nasheed is going to be able to exp be able to explain this one and be able to debunk anything that's stated in this video. I wonder how he's going to be able to do that. I wonder how anybody who says that Zionism is bullshit and there is no Jewish puppeteer. I wonder how y'all going to be able to explain this one then. Even though there's dozens, and not even exaggerating with the word dozens, of examples of these things occurring. All because you make a statement like this. You don't use the word tyke. You don't use no yid. You don't make implications of extermination or destruction towards that community of the small hats. All you have to do is point out and make historical references that further shoot, further prove that the Atska Nazis and the Khazars that come from the Caucasus Mountains aren't who you think they are, which is the chosen ones. But hey, maybe all this foolishness and all this stuff going on in cybernetic Babylon is like what a Small hat once said in the song, this is God's plan to reveal the foolishness and to debunk certain fallacies 
that have been going on in the world, especially in the so-called black community. So I had to keep this video concise, and you know me, man. I got more content that will be coming on the way. Peace out, everybody, and one love.